Godzilla Jr., also called Little One or just Jr., is the adopted son in the Heizai series of films that first appears in Godzilla vs. Mechagodzilla 2 in 1993 and eventually takes his father's place as king of the monsters at the end of Godzilla vs. Destroya. As a hatchling, Junior resembles a small version of Godzilla with blue skin, a gray underbelly, small dorsal plates, and large eyes. As a toddler, Junior looks like Manila with a chubby build, green skin, a yellow underbelly, and large eyes. As a subadult, Junior closely resembles Godzilla, only shorter, hunched over, and with green skin, a yellow underbelly, and small dorsal plates. As an adult, Junior looks identical to Godzilla. Godzilla Jr.'s egg was laid by a Godzilla Asaurus on a Danoa island in the Bering Sea millions of years ago. The egg was stolen by a Tronodon and taken to its nest. Millions of years later, one of the irradiated Tronodon eggs in the nest hatched into Rodan who looked after the Godzilla Asaurus egg like his own brother. Godzilla arrived on the island looking to claim the egg as his own and fought Rodan for it. Later, Rodan realized that the creature inside of the egg was of Godzilla's species and not his own, so he sacrificed himself to save Godzilla from Mechagodzilla 2. Godzilla then adopted the baby as his own son. Here now, we have some of Godzilla Jr.'s abilities on the Monster Wikipedia page. Telepathy. Godzilla Jr. is capable of telepathic communication with Godzilla, Rodan, and Miki Segusa. Radiation absorption. Junior is capable of absorbing radiation that he is exposed to. Exposure to Godzilla's radiation mutated Junior from a dinosaur hatchling into a young Godzilla. Exposure to the uranium explosion on Birth Island turned Junior into a subadult Godzilla. And exposure to the radiation released by Godzilla at his death revived Junior and turned him into the new Godzilla. Atomic Breath. As little Godzilla, Junior can spit a stream of atomic bubbles. As a subadult, Junior spits a stronger atomic heat beam that is still not as powerful or fully formed as Godzilla's. Regeneration. Like Godzilla, Junior possesses the capacity to regenerate wounds fairly quickly. Junior healed from a deep bite wound in his neck inflicted by Destroya in a matter of hours. After absorbing Godzilla's radiation, Junior was able to actually rise from the dead. So with all that being said, Junior must have some weaknesses, right? He sounds pretty damn badass. In fact, he is apparently identical to freaking Godzilla when he grows up. So what the hell? He has weaknesses, right? Well, check this out. Junior's biggest disadvantage is that he is small and easy prey for larger and more fearsome monsters. Godzilla's enemies will often use Junior as a way to attack Godzilla emotionally. Space Godzilla captured Junior in a crystal prison, while Destroya killed him right in front of Godzilla. Junior also is not nearly as strong as his father and can be fatally wounded by other monsters' attacks. So, there you have it guys, some of Godzilla Jr.'s traits and abilities. What are your thoughts on such? And do you think we might see him in a future film? Even though he was not in the cave descriptions on the end of Skull Island, he still might be implemented into future films. What do you think? And what sort of scenes would you like to see him in? Let me know in the damn comment section. Thank you. I am the Iceman. Please like this video and subscribe to the page if you haven't. Peace with you.